Ever pondered on the journey of Apple becoming the tech titan it is today? It all started in the mid-70s, in the humble setting of a suburban garage in Los Altos, California. Here, two ambitious young men, Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak, decided to challenge the status quo. Their vision? To bring the power of computing to the fingertips of everyday people. In 1976, under the name Apple Computer Inc., their journey officially began. The garage, belonging to Jobs' parents, became the birthplace of a revolution. An era of personal computing was on the horizon, and these two young men were its heralds. Their shared dream and relentless pursuit of innovation gave rise to a company that would forever change the way we interact with technology. Thus began the journey of what would soon become a revolution in the tech industry. The seeds of innovation were sown with the Apple I and II. In the late 70s, Apple introduced the world to the concept of personal computing with their first two groundbreaking products. The Apple I, a sleek, minimalist design, was a game-changer. But it was the Apple II that truly captured the imagination of the public. Under the hood of its iconic beige case, the Apple II boasted color graphics, a first in the industry, and an open architecture, allowing for hardware expansion. It was more than just a machine, it was a gateway to a new world. One where technology wasn't just for experts or corporations, it was for everyone. The success of these inventions didn't only establish Apple as a key player in the tech industry, but it also revolutionized the way we think about computers and their role in our lives. The Apple I and II set the stage for a new era of personal computing. 1984 wasn't like George Orwell's 1984 thanks to Macintosh. In the midst of a digital age where the personal computer was still a novelty, Apple took a bold step that would forever change our interaction with technology. The creation of the Macintosh was nothing short of a revolution. This wasn't just another computer. It was the first mass-market personal computer that brought an integral graphical user interface and mouse right to your fingertips. Imagine a world without a mouse or a graphical interface. Tough, right? That's because the Macintosh made these features so integral to our computing experience that we can hardly imagine a world without them. Apple didn't just create a product, they created an experience, a gateway to an unexplored digital realm that was now accessible to everyone, not just the tech savvy. Macintosh didn't just change Apple, it changed the world. The Macintosh revolutionized the personal computing experience. In the late 90s, Apple saw the return of its prodigal son, Steve Jobs. After a 12-year absence, Jobs came back to the company he co-founded, bringing with him a new vision and a drive to innovate. It was a time of turmoil for Apple. The company was on the brink of bankruptcy, struggling to stay afloat in an ocean of rapidly evolving technology. Jobs' return sparked a beacon of hope. His leadership and creative genius steered Apple's engineers towards new horizons, daring them to defy the norms and redefine the tech industry. Jobs didn't just bring Apple back from the brink, he led it into a new era of innovation and growth. Under Jobs' guidance, Apple launched groundbreaking products that revolutionized the way we interact with technology. His relentless pursuit of perfection and his commitment to think different transformed Apple from a falling star into a supernova that continues to shine brightly today. Steve Jobs' return marked the start of a golden era for Apple. The 21st century ushered in a new era for Apple with the iPod, iPhone, and iPad. As the new millennium dawned, Apple was ready to take the world by storm with a suite of revolutionary products that would forever change our relationship with technology. The first of these game changers was the iPod, introduced in 2001. This sleek, portable music player redefined how we listen to music. Gone were the days of bulky Walkmans and limited CD collections. The iPod offered a pocket-sized library of thousands of songs putting the power of choice at the fingertips of music lovers worldwide. Next came the iPhone in 2007. Apple's vision was not just to create a phone but to reinvent the phone. And reinvent, they did. The iPhone transformed the mobile phone from a mere communication device into a personal assistant, gaming console, music player, and so much more. It was an all-in-one device with a sleek design and an intuitive user interface that captivated consumers and set a new standard for smartphones. Finally, in 2010, Apple once again redefined personal computing with the iPad. This tablet combined the functionality of a laptop with the portability of a mobile device. It was a revolutionary idea that changed the way we consume media, browse the internet, and even create art. The iPad was more than a gadget. It was a tool for creativity and productivity, making technology more accessible and intuitive than ever before. 
These three products, the iPod, iPhone, and iPad, were more than just devices. They were revolutions in their respective fields, pushing the boundaries of what was possible and reshaping entire industries. They were a testament to Apple's innovative spirit and commitment to creating products that are not only functional, but also transformative. These revolutionary products catapulted Apple into a global tech giant. The iPod, iPhone, and iPad were not just products, they were cultural phenomena, symbols of a new age of digital innovation and personal technology, and they were just the beginning of Apple's journey in the 21st century. Apple's innovation role didn't stop with the iPhone and iPad. The company continued to break boundaries and redefine what technology can do for us. Let's dive into some of Apple's recent innovations that continue to shape the future of technology. The Apple Watch, launched in 2015, was a game changer. It wasn't just a watch, it was a fitness tracker, a health monitor, a mini iPhone on your wrist. The watch allowed us to leave our phones at home and still stay connected. It gave us a new way to manage our health and fitness with features like heart rate monitoring and step counting. Then came the AirPods in 2016. These wireless earbuds revolutionized the way we listen to music, take calls, and interact with Siri, Apple's voice-activated assistant. The AirPods Pro with noise cancellation and customizable fit took listening experience to a whole new level, but Apple's innovation didn't stop at hardware. The company made a massive foray into services. Apple Music launched in 2015 quickly became one of the most popular music streaming services. Apple TV Plus, introduced in 2019, brought Apple into the world of original programming with shows and movies that have won numerous awards. The company also made strides in privacy and sustainability. Apple has made a strong commitment to privacy, with features like end-to-end -end encryption in iMessage and FaceTime, and the ability to control which apps have access to your data. On the sustainability front, Apple announced in 2020 that it aims to be 100% carbon neutral by 2030. Apple's recent innovations are not just about creating new products, they're about creating a better future, a future where technology is more integrated into our lives, where our data is secure, and where our actions are sustainable. So, from the Apple Watch to AirPods, from Apple Music to Apple TV+, from privacy to sustainability, Apple's recent innovations continue to shape the future of technology. Today, Apple stands as one of the most influential tech companies on the planet. From its humble beginnings in a California garage to its current status as a global tech goliath, Apple's story is one of relentless innovation and vision. Apple's influence is seen not just in the world of technology but in our everyday lives. From the way we communicate to how we work, learn, and entertain ourselves, Apple's products have become an integral part of our daily routines. Take a moment to imagine a world without the convenience of smartphones, the magic of music at your fingertips, or the power of portable computing. It's hard, right? That's the Apple effect. And it's not just about the products. Apple's design philosophy, its commitment to user experience, its focus on privacy, and its knack for trendsetting, have all set the bar high in the tech industry. Apple's influence has other tech companies striving to emulate its success, leading to a culture of creativity and innovation that benefits us, the end users. Apple's reach extends beyond the tech industry. Its economic impact is substantial, with a market capitalization that surpasses many countries' GDP. It's a major job creator, an environmental leader, and a philanthropic force. But what makes Apple truly remarkable is its ability to constantly reinvent itself. Even today, it continues to push the boundaries of what's possible in technology. From the new M1 chips that are revolutionizing computing, to the potential of augmented reality, to the promise of Apple Car, the company is always looking forward, always innovating. Apple's journey from a garage to a global tech titan is indeed a testament to innovation and vision. Here's to the future where Apple continues to redefine technology.